In this video, you will learn everything there is to know about taking screenshots on your MacBook. So firstly, let's start with the simplest keyboard shortcut, Command Shift plus 3, which will take a screenshot of the entire screen of your MacBook. As you can see, after pressing this shortcut, a little screenshot banner appears over here. I can either dismiss it by swiping right or click on it to edit the screenshot. If I decide that I don't want to make any changes, I can simply click done and as you can see the screenshot just appeared on my desktop. Now the more advanced way of taking screenshots is instead of pressing command shift 3, you press command shift 4, which will bring out this crosshair over here. So what you can do with this shortcut is either select a portion of your screen that you want to capture, which honestly isn't the best thing you can do because this shortcut offers way more. Oh, and the bonus tip is you can click escape to escape out of your screenshot if you decide that you don't want to take it anymore. So let's go back to the Command Shift 4 shortcut and if you click on the spacebar as well, it will let you choose a window to capture fully, so you don't have to bother selecting it manually. Now if I simply click on my trackpad, my MacBook will only take a screenshot of the app that was highlighted. Now if you still decide that you want to manually select the area that you want to capture as a screenshot, there are a few handy tricks that goes with it as well. If you started the selection in the wrong place, you can hold down spacebar on your keyboard and you will be able to move the selection. Also, if you want to select something from a center, hold down the Option key and the selection will expand from the center where you clicked. And one last keyboard shortcut is if you have a MacBook that has a touch bar, pressing Command, Shift and 6 will take a screenshot of your MacBook's touch bar.